Hello and welcome. It is Friday. It is Friday the 30th of June, so we're basically in July. It's really, yeah, the end of the month, the start of July. And logging in today to FIFA Ultimate Team, and we're going to see what we have in Shapeshifters Team 3. We'll have some icons, we'll have some players, um, we'll have some SPCs, we'll probably have some, I don't know, objectives as well. Generally, we'll just, uh, there we go. We have a Pogba as a striker, we have a Loris as a midfielder, a Jal Felix as a cam, which seems a bit strange, but there you go. The final week of shapeshifters is upon us, and with more players shapeshifting across the pitch, log in daily and complete daily upgrade SPCs to earn some exciting rewards. Look out for new shapeshifter items, including premium shapeshifters and shapeshifter icons in Team 3 with an additional mini-release on Sunday. Get started now with this 84 plus triple pack granted to you. So we're going to have a one pack to open for sure. Something I do have is something I wanted to address straight off the bat is that earlier on today, FIFA gave out some compensation packs for some of the Team of Season Moments packs from the Team of Season or Team of Season Moments upgrade SPC did not contain some Team of the Season player items. This was previously addressed and we've started to roll out correcting packs to impacted players in games. If you did the SPC where the description wasn't correct, you'll get the reward. I did two and I got two duplicates. So I have these two and I'm hoping there's going to be an SPC available for me to put them into. Um, yeah, we'll have a look. We'll just see what's there really. We'll do the normal routine of running through objectives, through milestones into SPCs and then we'll look at the team and all that kind of jazz that we've got there. So first up, here is the daily SPC. So this is going to be probably a bronze player like we've had before. A shapeshifter player pack is the end reward for seven completions. Shapeshifter cup is here. Same as before. Basically, probably with exactly the same. This won't change, surely. One shapeshifter, three. A minimum of three shapeshifters, max chemistry, one loan. That makes sense. Um, the objective is shapeshifters Gavi as a Spanish league right back. So I get the feeling we've had quite a lot. Of, to be honest, we've had quite a lot of most positions at this stage of the game. So it's not really, oh, that's brand new. We've not had anything of that kind of nature there before. But yeah, very good pace probably an anchor on him just because the defending you'd you'd want higher physicals as well and then he'll give him perfect pace as well so yeah that's a decent option there and it's essentially it's a free card because you're just playing games scoring uh, assisting goals with Spanish players scoring goals with players with dribbling assisting three goals with crosses and then winning eight squad battles with three Spanish players in his starting team. So it's nothing nothing too strenuous at all. And packs as you go along for the rewards. So that's fine. Then we have the normal... Yeah, the XP section. Play games with at least two shapeshifters in your team. You should be able to manage that by now, I'm sure. Unless you've been really unlucky. Um, shapeshifters... Five, we have play seven, play two in draft, play five in squad battles with a Bundesliga and a Saudi player on your team, fair enough. Assist two using a Brazilian player in the same match, score three headers, win six with three Germans, gold upgrade, silver upgrade. And then weekly objectives as well. That's fine, that's pretty straightforward stuff. Same as what we've had before. I've nearly completed Levi Le Lemeca, Lumeca. And Bravo is on 42 out of 50. So we're working through there. Milestones, nothing. Obviously, season progress is continuing. With the XP that's available in store, we should get this. I'll probably take the one of five shapeshifters. Uh, then we've got that. And then we've got these going up to the top one which I'm probably going to take the 2584s, to be honest. But we'll see what we got. So, yeah, two um, Team of Season and Team of Season moments in store. Woo, we have a Trent as a striker. 
Now, him as a striker, because obviously he's had his position changed in real life from being a defender primarily to a midfielder. Five-star skill moves, four-star weak foot. Alternative positions, cam and centre forward. I mean, it's a strong card. It is a strong card. No real weaknesses. So, chemistry cards, you can basically take your pick. Surprisingly, he hasn't got any like flare passes and stuff like that. But what is this going to cost? Five segments. Five segments. 87, 88, 88, 89 and 89. Okay, I mean, the five star skill moves will attract people. The fact that it's Trent as a striker, the fact that there's um, English links, Liverpool links, people are going to be all over that. But five segments is a price SPC, especially with that Kante there, which essentially is a better card. Um, what else do we have? Upgrade, 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 upgrade. 90 plus icon again. Year in review still, which I'm avoiding, frankly. Shapeshifters. For a mixed player pack, this is going to be a low requirement. Yeah, 65, 7 from the same league, 3 from the same club, maximums. Yeah, that's that'll be easy, but we won't, we're not going to do it now. It's a mixed player pack. Um, silver shifting things back again. We like those. We'll do this one straight away. And hopefully, the team of season thing is back. That I can put those two guys into that. He can go in there. One bronze. And we've done one. One out the way. Two rare gold players in. Team sees, team sees a moments upgrade. So we can basically, I can use Fekir in one of these squads and um, Kaku in the other one. Which just makes it easier overall really. So we'll put a higher rated one in the higher one and then the lower rated one in the lower one. I have no idea what kind of squad requirements I'm going to need. So we'll put in... We'll go all 83s and then I'll bump it. See where we need. So it will give us a tradable team of season or team of season moments. It's not a pick. It is just you get given one. Uh, but the fact that it's tradable means it's well worth it. We are short, so let's get some eighty fours on the bench. Flavich, Canales, Odegaard, Munain. I have no idea how I'm gonna need, so we'll grab five. One, two, three, four, um, five. Nope, we need more. We need more. Um, Busquets, James, oops, Tonali, oh, we are still needing all these, okay, there we go, so where did we, what did we get to, we got to 191, 784s, and 383s. It's not too bad. Plus, we actually use up the feck here, which is an untradable duplicate. And we can go back to the other one, which then frees up access to all the stuff in the school club, which is useful. And while I'm here, actually, before I complete um, this, let's go in and have a look at the shapeshifters. Can we do this this way? I think we can. Uh, shapeshifters, I've gone past them. I've sailed past them. So which one is new? Becker, these are not new. Buffon's not new. Zaha's not new. Pepe's not new. Cambe's Hazard is new. El Nezre is new. Okay, so he is the one for this, for perfect chemistry. Power header, flare trait, outside of foot shot trait. Really good in the air. Decent pace. The so finishing isn't the best at 88. And the dribbling could use a little bit of a boost. I guess why he's the special card. All of the wings for him. Five star skill with three star weak foot is okay. But yeah, hopefully the other ones are a better group of players. Let's have a look. So Van Dijk we've had. Dembele we've had. Pogba is new. 
five star, five star Pogba as a striker is going to cause some trouble for people. Right wing and striker, right mid and centre forward as well. The dribbling is mad. May need an engine for that little bit of a boost. The shooting is really good. The physical's perfect strength. That's his only perfect stat. But he's got lots above 95. Oh my word. Okay, so flare passes, outside of foot shot trait, power header, flare, finesse shot and injury prone. That's a sick card to use. And he's six foot three frame as well is going to make him interesting. Marshall, Bruno, Cruz, Aru. Oh, Joe Felix is a new one. Five stars, five, five star again. Centre mid or a cam. He's a degree of Pogba by a, yeah, a fair degree. Excuse me. Fair degree off Pogba. Fair amount of four good traits there. Flare swerve pass outside of foot shot trait and flare passes. Loris as a as a centre midfielder. Swerve pass and flare passes. But he's still cautious with crosses as a central midfielder. I wonder if that actually means cautious with attacking crosses. I don't know. Six foot two frame. Five star weak foot. Low agility, but everything else looks high apart from free kick accuracy. The finishing is not good, but the rest is good. He's got perfect penalties, long passing, shot power, and jumping. It's an interesting card. They are interesting cards. They're shapeshifters for a reason. We've got Klosterman as a left back. Five star skill moves and the pace, the crossing. Dribbling is good apart from agility. And then really good physicals as well. Giant. Throw in a flare trait as well. That's pretty good. Harry Maguire's striker. Was that an old one or is that a new one? I don't think I saw that in one of the other segments. Five star skill moves, but his body type is good, just going to be clunky. That shooting is mad though. Perfect shot power, perfect penalties, perfect strength. Big old boost on the pace. Big old agility and balance boost needed. But that's pretty good. Mares has been there. Bumacana has been there. Richardson has been there. Vitinha has been there. Ruslan is new. He's gone from right back to left back. Also right mid. Going forward isn't much. But really good pace. Really good physicals. Really good defending. It's not a hugely impressive card. For a 94 you would probably expect more. None of it. Only pace is the only base stat above 94. Yeah. Not convinced with that. Bayer and Titi have been already. All these. Gavi, obviously, we've seen. Ganduzi, Giroud, Bravo, Gavadiol have all been seen. Okay. That looks like all of them. So, Trent, Pepe, El Nesre, Pogba, Loris, Felix, Maguire, Klosterman, Rusmon, and Gavi. That's what we have. But now, we have to get this out of the way. It looks like a good squad. Obviously, the highest is your Pogba at 97. So, that's what everybody's going to be wanting. That's where everybody's going to be like aiming for. Unless you particularly like your Spurs fan, Chelsea fan, Man United fan, want Maguire, Felix or Loris. Um, Trent is going to be, again, popular, like we said. So, it's a, it looks like a good selection. Quite... Prem heavy, Loris, Felix, Maguire, and Trent, but it is what it is. Um, oh, we've gone over already. Let's put some 85s in just in case we're sure. We actually, we could probably put some 83s in if we need to bring it down a notch. Um, Solar as well. So, yeah, we do need to go down. So, we'll take Mount, we'll take Havertz. We'll take Rice. We'll take Martinez. Cool. We'll take Diaby. Oh my word, we can go down further. We need more 83s. Oh, um, bum, 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 bum. So the team does look good. We haven't seen the icons yet. I will check those out by the news release section before 
do tens. How many of these? 80, oh, they're all 83s, that's why. 83 and 84 squad thing means that we can comfortably get rid of these. I need to go down lower. Nevers, silver, stones, and then can we put an 82 on just in case? Right, 83, get rid of all the 84s. Cool, can we then take him out for an 82? We can. Oh my word, how many? I underestimated this massively as to how much we could get away with with the fact that we've got the one highly rated player in. It is skewing it more than I thought it would, so let's go... Ah, that's where the cutoff point is. Cool. So this will get us a tradable team of the week. So, worst case scenario is we get a duplicate, he goes on the list. Best case scenario is Messe, Mbappe, Salah, anything along those lines. So, let's... Oh, we've got an, oh yeah, we've got the thing as well. For the one objective, one completion. And we've got the 384s for just logging in today, which is what they gave us at the start. So, we'll open that. So, this is going to be a good few packs ending with the team of the season one, hopefully. So what's going to be at the front? I'm assuming the things... Oh, it's just these. And they can go in the squad. In the club, sorry. So yeah, we've got a lot of things today. Obviously, it's a Friday. Obviously, it's a promo shift day. Lights up on this. It's a Spaniard. Is it going to be a Lathabal? That's nice from a random pack. So we've got Shapeshifters Team 3. We have Shapeshifters SPC. Trent Alexander-Arnold, 94 ready striker. We have the Shapeshifters Challenge number 7, the SPC for the Mixed Players pack, and then the Shapeshifter Daily Login SPC, which is going to be there for the next 7 days, I think it was. So, good stuff there. Daily rewards as per normal, plus with big players in pack, give you a good chance to get something back from that. We've got the Shapeshifters Cup, which several, some people will ignore. I understand that. I'm probably going to be one of them. I'm away for a few days this week as well, so I won't be completely... Um, involved with that then the shapeshifter objective gavi as you've seen um the daily login upgrade objective which is what gives us the, re 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 the rewards from the daily login spc and then as always shapeshifters shapeshifters five shapeshifters six and shapeshifters weekly objectives the normal stuff that we've had so there's a lot of content there today it's good stuff Hopefully, some of those shapeshifters do come out of packs. Personally, I would love that Pogba. Second would probably be Jao Felix. But the icons do look tasty. We will have a look at them in a second. Just got a couple of these packs to cycle through. And then we'll head over there. I thought that was a funny colour upgrade there. That's going to be a Neymar. That's a pretty good pull from a two-gold player pack. He's going to go towards Kante, no doubt. No doubt. So, yeah, that's what we have. So, oh, shapeshifter from a pack. Laurie, no, Russilon. Okay, that's fine. I mean, it's a 94 rated shapeshifter. I will take that all day long. And I certainly did not expect that. <laughs> it's not tradable, but he's it's it's there in the club. We like that. Not... Like I said when I was looking at them, not the best one, but it's a 94 German league right back, French, so good good links there. So we will happily, happily take that. 580 uh, plus cards. This is the first daily login reward cell, like tier. De Vry is good. I think we used him earlier on. Yes, we did. No dupes, which is very welcome. I seem to have gone awful lot of dupes recently for things. So, cool. We'll do the 384s, which is what we got just for logging in today, which is what the initial message told us. This is not tradable, so he there could be one behind. But we've got a Muller to start with. These packs are coming in nicely. Mount, I almost used in most of the SPCs there. We will quick sell recover him. So then we'll go to the Team of the Week player pack. Hope for a lights up with this, because if I 
No, his light's down. It's not going to be a good one. I don't know who the Nigerian centre forward is. Yeah, we'll keep that in the club. <laughs> he's not going to sell for much. And then the team of season pack, which we're going to end with. And then this is the tradable one. So hopefully not English Football League, not rest of the world. It's a moment. If that's Fekir again, oh my word. Literally put him in, got him out. That's, it's so predictable sometimes. But it is tradable. So to be honest, I'll put him up for max and then I will use him. I'll take him off the list at some point and use him. So if somebody buys him, somebody buys him. If somebody doesn't, they don't. Um, super Nano Pack. What? Okay, we have silly money at the moment, so we will do that. Shift, 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 stop. To be honest, yeah, we'll just do both of these. So total, that's... they've. Yeah, I'll do that. And then stuff up here is just... Yeah, it's not worth it. To be honest, these aren't worth it, but they're small amounts, so why not? Super Nano Pack. That's a new one for EA. <laughs> Weird old name, but there we go. This is only going to be three cards, so it'll be probably three real brush ones. Yeah, I thought so. That's going to be Luke Shaw, I bet. No dupes? No dupes? Come on, no dupes? Well, this is lagging. Are we going to have to end the video there? It does rather look like it. I may have to go out and come back in. Anyway, in addition to that, yeah, we've got Sol Campbell, Luis Figo, two Luis Figos. Oh, no, we're not. We're in. It's That was really slow. There must be many people in the store. That's probably why. That is why it's going at two miles an hour. But yes, two Luis Figo um, icons. One strike as a striker, one as a central midfielder. Um, Sebastian Schweinsteiger as a 97 rated centre back. That is a big shift up from what his cards have been before. Then we have a left wing Sol Campbell with perfect pace. This is really slow, but we're going to keep on persisting. A left wing Sol Campbell with perfect pace, and then a Thierry on Ricard, 98 pace, 98 dribbling, as a right winger. Which is which is a shift from his normal striker slash left wing position. Please be tradable. I'll I'll bring him back and please be tradable. Yay. We'll do the other one just for the sake because it's there and it's cheap and I've still got a draft token I can get something back from there. So five gold players. All tradable, I think you said. Lights are up. It's ZH. That's not great. But yeah, so five new icons. To, well, four new icons, five new options because there's two Lewis Figos. Um, so that looks like everything. There's a lot of content there today, enough to keep people happy. Um, I'm a, <laughs> I am away tomorrow and away on Sunday. So actually, potentially back on Sunday. We'll have to see how the how the day plans out. But yeah, definitely away tomorrow. So yeah, have a good weekend. And I will most potentially speak to you on Sunday afternoon, roughly around 6 o'clock. Good luck getting SP, um, shapeshifters from your packs. Obviously, I got lucky with one Rousselon so far. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff there. Pogba, Henri, Feinstein, as you can see on the right-hand side, look like the biggest cards available. So that's where we'll leave it. Thank you for watching and goodbye.